Personal growth is this weird thing that happens when one day you wake up and you realize, holy shit, I don't suck anymore. Hi. Hey. It's August. It's Jenna. Okay. It's the month of August. I am Jenna. I'm... Yeah, hi. <laughs> in my notes for this video, I instead of writing it's August, I wrote it's awful. <laughs> I think that was a typo. <laughs> but who really knows? Personal growth. What is that? Who am I? How did I become this person? July, for no one reason in particular, was a month of just like a lot of change and growth for me as a person. I didn't really set out like July, I'm gonna get my shit together. But somehow, I feel like I sort of did. <laughs> I don't know. It's really weird realizing that, like, maybe you're not so much um, of a mess as you thought you were. Wow, I am actually a person who's functioning and doing the things that people do. Whoa. <laughs> but yeah, basically, I've just kind of had a lot of time on my hands in July, and I've been doing sort of a lot of more things for myself than I normally do, and I've just kind of realized a lot about myself, so we're gonna talk about it, I guess. It's one of those weird things that I didn't even realize kind of how unhappy I was with myself until I sort of wasn't that way anymore. I didn't know that I didn't like all these things until I changed them, and then I was like, wow, I'm so much of a better person now, and... I like the things I'm doing and I feel good about the things I'm doing. Never say no to like a little soul searching <laughs> uh, because you never know. Like maybe you feel like you don't need it and you might. My tea is cold. It's only 10.30 today. I'm filming early. Wow. Anyways, that was a tea break. In the last month, um, I've realized a lot of things about myself, um, and one of the big things was I was kind of unhappy, well, I, yeah, I was unhappy with the way I was dressing and the way I was expressing myself and, like, who I was, um, I've always been a very feminine person, um, and the last few years I sort of shied away from that, um, but basically I realized that it was really stupid to be doing that and that I should just kind of accept that I am a very feminine person and go with that. And honestly, it's made my life so much easier. I never struggle with picking outfits anymore because they just come to me. I'm just like, oh, I'll just wear these things together because I'm pretty and I just like wearing things that are cute, right? Um, so it's made my life a hundred times easier. Um, and also, I feel better wearing the clothes that I'm wearing and being the person that I am. Um, so that was like a big thing, and I didn't even really realize that I was unhappy with that before. I just knew that I struggled a lot with wanting to dress a certain way, but not really knowing how to, you know, shop for those kind of clothes or that kind of stuff. But a big thing for me that sort of has changed in the last, like, month or so is being on my own. Um, I'm a very social person. I love being around people, and I thrive in groups and being, you know, um, with people and talking and being out and about. I hate being in the house for too long or doing things, you know, by myself. Even if it's something, like, easy or simple that I can do alone, I'm just like, oh, why not do it with someone else? This last month, I've sort of gotten better at doing things by myself, and this wasn't really, like, on purpose. I wasn't like, I'm gonna become independent this month. It just happened that, um, a lot of my friends left town for the month of July, so I was just kind of on my own. But you know what? It, it, it has actually been the best thing for me. I got my driver's license at the end of June, which also helps, I think, with this, because before that, I was like, that 18-year-old girl that can't drive herself anywhere, so I'm like, hey, you want to pick me up? Or like, sorry, I gotta take the bus, so it's gonna take me two hours to meet you. But I think that's also helped a lot, um, getting my license and just being able to kind of do things for myself. But um, as I get older, I think that I'm kind of coming to appreciate alone time more and you know, going to the mall by myself or going to just to the... I'm not going to say the grocery store because I don't go wander the aisles of the grocery store, but like things like that. You know what? I'm just going to like do this because I want to do it and I don't need someone else to come with me. And I'm just going to you know do kind of like what I want to do. 
um, and that has been so just like such an experience like I've never had that because of course like I, I wasn't independent at all before but now I'm just very it's like I feel like as much as I like doing things with other people now before I was very like I need you to be there with me and now I'm just like hey you want to come but like if not I'm gonna do it anyways because like I don't care it actually turned into such like a beautiful experience for me in that I found a lot of ways to do things for myself that I hadn't had before and also it gave me a good chance to connect reconnect with old Pete friends so I feel so much happier than I have in such a long time and I feel so much more myself than I have in such a long time just doing the things I want to do and doing them for me and dressing like I want to and not caring like oh my god everyone always says like don't care about what other people think but like seriously don't care about what other people think. It is the best thing I have ever done for myself. Like, I can't even put into words how good it feels to dress, put clothes on, and be like, I don't know if this looks okay, but like, I don't care. Like, whatever. I like it together, you know? But like, seriously, like, honest, honestly, do what you want, especially with your clothes, because it will change your life. I'm doing a lot of things that I thought I would never be able to do. For example, I was always terrified to get my driver's license, and I did that. Uh, another thing, I am moving out soon, um, which is, I don't know if you can tell, but like I got new bedding because I'm taking it to my new place. So, ooh, look out for a new filming spot soon. I'm an adult. I can cook things and vacuum and wash my own clothes. This is like a really small thing, but like something I always wanted to do was like, and um, I'd always wanted to try spin class, but I'd always kind of been like, well, I don't have money and I'm kind of nervous like I don't know what it'll be like this month I was like I'm gonna just do it and I I did it and I love it and now I go like three times a week uh, I'm going tomorrow <laughs> I did it for myself and I love it and it makes me feel so like empowered and I'm just like, yeah I can do this so like find something to do and for yourself and do it because you're gonna have so much fun and you're gonna love your life and you're gonna be fit and happy um <laughs> not that you have to be fit to be happy like also fuck it and live your dreams but like that's just something for me this is a big one holy moly um i don't cry every day anymore uh literally probably <laughs> i've cried like most every day since like january or like honestly since birth i only cry for the appropriate reasons like i'm in pain or someone yelled at me or something I before i had a lot of issues like with emotion I guess and so like my response to anything sort of was kind of just to cry I was just like I don't know how to react so I'm, I'm just gonna cry I sort of mentioned this already but like it came out and I never thought I'd be able to do that and I did it and it wasn't scary and it was so just amazing and beautiful and I'm so happy now all in all I literally just feel more like myself than I ever have and I didn't even know that was possible because of course I've been myself this entire time but like I just feel so absolutely Jenna and all the time and I just feel like I'm turning into this person who actually like has a personality and is unique and different but also like in the best possible way where people aren't like Ugh, but people are like yeah like just send all your friends away for a month and you will become this amazing person. So that's my advice for you. Do the things you want to do. And like, oh my god, you will become so happy. <laughs> like, ah. And like, obviously I know it's not that easy for some people. And like, this is such like a random thing that like all these things just kind of like fell into place for me in like this one month. But like, I turn eight, n I don't turn 18. I turn 19 in like a month. So I'm kind of like relieved, honestly. I'm like, oh, I'm finally getting my life together. I don't feel like a mess anymore. And like, oh my god, honestly, I'm probably gonna be a mess for like the rest of my life. But it just feels nice to like understand myself a lot better and feel like things that I've been wanting to do for a long time are happening. I'm Jenna. Hi, I'm like extra Jenna now. I'm really, really Jenna. Um, and I'm also really excited about that, if you can't tell. I had the caffeine. I'm so exhausted from all this volunteering. Which is also probably why I'm a bit, like, uh, uh squirrely. <laughs> this was a fun little chat, and I'm glad we had it. Okay, um, glad we had this little chat. Uh, I talk about things like this a lot on my channel, if you are not subscribed to me. Um, you should be, if you aren't. Um, but yeah, mostly we talk about things, we talk about my thoughts and feelings, and what's going on in my life, and we chat, and have a good time. I'm gonna go not to bed because it's only 10 45 and like I go to bed at 2 a.m. so whoa <laughs> I love you guys have a good sleep
that's my new outro because I always film at night, so I'm just like throwing it in there. Okay, uh, yeah, bye, 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 ah. Uh. I have all the energy right now. Holy shit. <laughs>